Hello, geeks and gamers, and welcome back to Demon Souls Remake. In the last episode, we made it through a Area 4-2, uh, which was the most bullshit area I think we've been through, um, and finally got to the boss, the old hero, um, and ended up beating him, uh, which was great. Uh, and then right after, right before we ended, I mentioned that homie here, who I released from his cell in Latria, uh, apparently is the one that's been killing some NPCs. Um, and I said I was going to look around, see if I can find him, uh, and and we're going to stop him from go ahead from killing these NPCs, because if he continues, he apparently will kill some pretty important people. So, I'm going to first talk to him real quick, I'm going to see if he uh, mentions anything about things, and then I'm going to kill him. I am indebted to you for your help in Latria. Without it, I would not have made it back. Now, I can go on with my work. And for that... Uh-huh. And what's your work, my guy? You. Is it killing people? Is it being a serial murderer? What is it? I have no business with you. Not yet. Do not be concerned. Oh, I'm pretty concerned, Life man. Life is hardly as precious as one might think. Life is hardly as precious. Okay. So we're doing this. If you wish to die so soon, why? Punched him right in the fucking you face. <laughs> Mephistopheles was right about you. Who? What the hell is that? Oh, he gave me his badass looking armor? Hell yeah. Okay, so yeah, we did the thing. He's gonna not be killing people anymore. And hopefully that doesn't affect my world tendency since I am here in the the Nexus. Um so yeah, you know, there's one of the NPCs that he fucking killed. Um There is, however, you know, some things that we need to go ahead and read through. Um I'm gonna no, that's not what I wanted to do. I need to send some shit to storage. Uh, I'm kind of tempted to put those in storage because, like, I'm never going to use them. Um, kunai with chain. Uh, obviously, yeah. Send those. Send that. Send that and that. The tracking bug matcher just takes up so much. Um. Well, there's nothing else really there. Okay. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on you. So let us very quickly find where Hiltless went. And we can read it. Am I missing it? Where the hell? God, winged spear, or... Oh, it's literally right here. It's the first fucking thing. Um, okay. So let's take that out real quick, and we can read the item gold. description on it, Don't and then immediately it store it. An Uchikatana is named... This Uchikatana is named for its lack of hilt. This blade appears somehow wet. Ugh. A fine piece of work with an intricate design forged by a famous swordsmith in a distant land. Extremely difficult to handle, owing to the fact that it must be held by the blade, inevitably injuring the wielder. Oh, it's, um... Oh my god, it's the, uh... Can't think of the name of it, but, uh... It, it, it's, it also appears in the rest of the Souls games. That it's literally one of the most powerful katanas that you can wield, but it does damage to you each turn. Um... Ooh, and it starts off... Very high. B scaling a dex. Ooh, man. My dex wielder might might end up wielding that. Um, but obviously for now, we're sending it back to storage. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on you. Um, okay. Let's go take a look at the new armor. Is that what I want? 
to do. I would be overburdened. Oh my god, dude. How? Why do I don't you have anything in my gold. in my inventory that's overburdening me except for the dragon bone smasher, and I really don't want to get rid of it. Um but I might not have much of a damn choice. Obviously, I've got all this damn moon grass that's <laughs> taking up a shit ton of space. That's only taking up two pounds. Ah, fine, we'll put the Dragon Bone Smasher in storage just for the moment. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch. Because I'm not like entirely sure I'm gonna use the blue armor. You have a heart of gold. Don't let them take it from you. It is a little bit better, and only a little bit heavier. Yeah, alright. And then for now, we'll just have to keep everything else on, but let's get Hello my... Again. I'm keeping a close watching. Dragon Bone Smasher back. You have a heart of gold. And then rather than wielding... Sorry, here we go. Rather than the ring that slowly is going to regenerate, um, we're going to put that on. Oh! oh. <laughs> that increases by a lot. God damn. Um, okay. Okay. I think we're ready to continue. So I went ahead and uh, looked up the next area that is recommended. And it is not recommended to jump straight from 4-2 to 4-3. It's actually recommended to go do 1-3, finishing out uh, the palace and gates of Boletaria um, here at the Inner Ward. So, that's where we're heading today. So, if you guys remember, uh, whenever we... How, how is my... Uh, so now of the Archstone of the Tower Queen, it is now, and of the Shadowmen. So I've got, I've got, I need to, I'll need to look up, um, I'll need to look up, uh, like what areas those affect. Anyway, if you guys remember, um, this thing said until I defeated an Archdemon, we can't do anything with it. Uh, now that we've defeated an Archdemon, we can. Oh, hey there. Uh, hey, man. You might want to go see a doctor about what's on your face. Or just, like, about your face in general, really. Dude was, was inviting me. You see that shit? Tempting. All right. Well, let's see what we. Uh, oh, that that fucking. If the cage is a rocking, don't come a knocking. These guys are gonna bust out, aren't they? Hey, Fido. Oh, somebody already has. Jesus, why do these dogs have so much more health? My God. You are emotional. Yeah, I mean, okay, a bit. I don't know what you expect of me. There's literal aggressive-ass dogs. Somebody stabbed that dude in the thigh. What dicks? Hello. Hidden path. Yeah, of course it is. I wonder if that's just going to be a shortcut later. So, we're all in agreement here that things are gonna bust out, right? Okay. Alright, I guess they're not. 
Okay, but we're all in absolute agreement that... Yep. Well, all right. <laughs> the obvious trap is obvious. Oh, oh, good. Yeah, I'm glad I... Glad I stopped to pick that. Um... Hi, guys. How are we, uh... How are we doing? We doing well today? That's... Not doing... Jack fucking shit to them. <laughs> Alright. I'm assuming had I got close to him, he would have Oh, what a dick. I'm assuming had I got close to him, he was going to do that anyway. So, may hopefully that damage, like, stays on him. Hey, guys. Hey, have you guys tried not absolutely sucking? <laughs> I know this is just going to be a dead end, but I want to see if anything happens. Hey there, you fat fuck. Um, alright, well, let's go down the obvious trap path, right? What the fuck are they all doing? Fat official, you might next time want to consider hiring better goods. Because these suck. Hmm. Meh. Which path I want to take? Um, uh, let's go this way. Yeah. Oh, how fancy, huh? <laughs> he was doing some spinny bitch kicks and all. Secret dagger and a stealth throwing dagger. Is it leading to the same place? Yeah, it's leading to the same place. Let's go back up then. Let's do that drop down. Let me see if I can also counter snipe some people. Sure can. Um, okay, so it looks like I can maybe jump from right here. There's also here. Can I not? Oh. Oh, well, okay. I mean, it looked like a spot that I'd be able to, right? And this is... Yeah, this path. Okay. Neat. Oh, blue eye night gauntlets. Oh, shit, what the fuck? Oh, it's you. Is he gonna continue? Yeah, he is. Come on. Just that axe in the face, my guy. Secret dagger. Uh, let's see if we can go. I think there was a ladder that was right here. Let's pop up there, see if there's any goodies. Ow. Now who the fuck threw that? 
The answer is within you. Some new moon grass. throwing shit at me. Where's that going? Oh, I was hoping I was gonna like maybe open up a secret. Yeah, my face. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Sometimes the uh, punching them in the face works, and it's hilarious. So you were the one shooting me. Like a dick. You guys aren't the only ones that can shoot a bow and arrow. Uh, did that arrow just curve? Pardon me, Morgan Freeman just called? He wants you to join a secret society of assassins? I don't know what to do. <laughs> Why does it look like he's trying to attack the uh, fat, fat official? D oh, alright. Just blink out of existence, that's fine. He popped back into existence. I kind of like can hit these guys a lot easier leading them than I can the fucking mana race. Try to do as much damage as I can to him, and then I'll pop him in there and fuck him up with my gold trusty hello. God damn it. <laughs> it fucked. Could you guys try not being uh, blindsidey bitches? That'd be great. There's a lot of just random ass passageways in this uh, in this area. I mean, I'm already digging it more than the last. Oh, hey there, buddy. Ah, oh, we meet again. Fancy that? Yeah. Hope you find something that suits you. I don't know, probably not. You selling anything new? Some late moon grass? Pretty sure he had that last time. He's now selling full moon grass and, ooh, a knight sword. Hello. Hello, hello. It's a strength, high strength based... Um, straight sword. He also now sells that crescent axe, the knight shield. Interesting. I mean, it's not like it's that much better. It's got five higher base. Uh, Hard times, eh? No, not really. I've got the money. I just don't have anything I want to buy from you. Ooh, a great sword. Hello. Obviously strength-based. Is that like the uh, Zweihander from the other games? Let's see. Yeah, pretty much is. I mean, I already got my, my Dragon Bone Crusher, so I don't really need that. Uh, it's also heavy AF. I know I've got the, the ring on now that gives me a lot of 
capacity, but still. No use keeping it, so I'm not gonna use it. Ow, shit. You guys are annoying. Oh, that was terrible. Excuse me, sir. There we go. Uh, anything else? Doesn't seem like it. I'm hearing a bunch of sounds that I really don't like. Me like uh, like you got a vendetta. <laughs> Ow. Oh, damn it, it put these on my hot bar. I don't want those on my hot bar. So the red eyed knights are also the ones that are out in front, or is the one that is at the beginning of the game that like is strategically placed just to fuck your ass up because he completely like the game leads you into a complete false sense of security with that that dude is literally just there to ruin your day <laughs> oh yeah rub your fat ass stomach like oh my god that did so much damage fuck me I'm sorry sir I didn't mean it <laughs> Just kidding, get fucked, fat ass. Um, should I go back to that first area now? Because I got that key ring. Let's see if let's see if it mentions like uh, iron ring of keys. That. <laughs> God damn it! This was this was before uh before they really got in depth with their um. Item descriptions. <laughs> I really need you guys to stop running at me. Like I owe you money. Isn't there... Yes, this. Ah, my ankles. Okay, how do I get down? Oh, I just yeet myself ah. over. Great, okay. Oh, hey, we're back right here. Well, now that I'm back right here, let's see if this opens up this pathway back here. It does not. This is, this is actually kind of a long walk back. I mean, you know, at least I don't have to go through anybody anymore. They're all dead. Uh, hop down. Hop down. Uh, turn around. And we're back. Okay. So, let's see what's up here. Okay, it's where the ladder was leading me in here. Hey, buddy. Um, I 
don't think I want to go further up yet. Time for shooting. Shooting what? Good grass. Oh, that's a boulder. good progress, though we are getting very close to the end of time. Not like uh, on this earth, I mean it's like the video. That is a lot of random ass arrows flying at me. <laughs> I was trying to go for the backstab, but that worked out. Right in the arm. <laughs> hey, buddy. Whoa. I suppose. Oh, hey there. Don't suppose I can... No, that ain't gonna happen. Damn it. Fine. Hi. Uh, why does it look like you're able to get up there, you know? Oh shit. Oh, overcompensated my aim there. This place is just full to the brim with archers. Like, if you are coming here without a bow and arrow of your own, have fun. Also, like this, this whole area, this vibe right here, it's giving me really like, like high bloodborne vibes. You know, kind of a gothic Victorian era setting looking sort of thing, and a bunch of random ass dudes just kind of walking around. You guys coming or? Well, you guys have fun. I'm gonna continue looking over here. Um, actually, this might be a pretty good spot to stop. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the video here. Um, we made some pretty good progress into this uh, into this area. Um, especially since it's only been about 20 minutes that we were actively in this area. So, if you did enjoy today's episode, as always, be sure to do the things that we YouTubers ask you to do. And until next time, game on.